during your watch, Marriott made a major acquisition, the largest acquisition it's ever made. It, it bought uh, Starwood for about $13.7 billion. Right. Uh, you were competing with a Chinese company at the time, Ambang. Yep. Uh, were you worried that you were overpaying? How did that bidding war go, and how did you actually win at the end? Well, it was a, it was a great process. It's a company that had been pursuing strategic alternatives. It had been for sale for most of 2015, and initially we thought it was too expensive. But the it got cheaper for us over the course of the year. In early 16, uh, Chinese surface and uh, throw in a, a rival bid before the shareholders vote. That's when OnBank comes in. Uh, and that throws a whole new wrinkle in it. Made it cost us a little bit more. Uh, but we still, to my surprise, uh, came out on top. So did you, Bill Marriott, say, look, I don't like to spend $13.7 billion for hotels. We'll just build them. Did he say your job is on the line if this doesn't work out? Uh, no. Uh, actually, he was, uh, um, I was very touched by his first reaction. Actually, his, his, maybe his second reaction. His first reaction, I called him on the phone and I said, uh, uh, I want to talk to you about buying Starwood, uh, but don't form any points of view yet, uh, because we need to take you through right. the financial model and the strategic and what model. Say? Uh, and he held himself back for three or four days, uh, because I, I was worried that without grounding, he would say, why on earth would you take this risk? Uh, but then I, I uh, got back, so I'm in, I, that was a phone call, because I was on the road. I got back into the office, and he said, he was thinking about the human side of this first. He said, Arnie, you know you don't have to do this. You're already working very hard. The company's going great. Um, there's going to be a lot more work if you buy Starwood. Uh, and you shouldn't feel like this is something you have to do. Uh, and he was thinking about it first from just, you know, my health and, and uh, sort of the way I lead my life.